What? Yeah, I'm actually currently paying for my order, and I'm waiting for my order. Just because your man's a racist. And we all, we're both on video. What's your name? My name is Steven. Steven. All right, we're here. This is Walmart, Yuba City, California. They're racist as fuck. Can I get my sweet tea, please? Huh? I'm a paying customer. The Walmart security, he got mad because I put the hoodie on. That's all he got mad for. Are you the manager? I am a customer service manager. Yes, Thank you, Pamela. Appreciate it. It's 108. Sorry about that. I appreciate it. You're doing your job on correctly, but Walmart seems to be having a, the security guard follow me around because I put the hoodie on in the store. I pay for the hoodie. This nigga still going to follow me around. He's still going to follow me around and make himself look stupid and then get mad at me because he following me around. I pay for my hoodie. I can't put it on then continue. Yes, I do got a receipt. Huh? Ask the fucking teller if I pay for my hoodie. Make a stop. Stop me if I'm stealing. Don't act like I'm, don't follow me around and, and disrespect me. Then if I have a receipt, you're trying to say he owes me an apology. Who, who do I get my apology from when I show you my receipt, sir? That's Steven, are you going to apology? He's my boss. He's telling me what to do. He's your boss, and who is the supervisor that I can get an apology from? Supervisor. Okay, then she, are you a part of this, ma'am? All I was asked to do something, and I'm here to do it. Okay. It's going to take... Go get the big guy. Go get the biggest guy you got. And get, bring him back out here. These niggas is crazy, man. Uh, call the law if you need to. You say you need to call the law. I haven't broken no crime, sir. And if you guys are ready to make a stop, then we're going to go. Get all of them down here, man. I'm not caring. All I asked for was a fucking tea. Look, man, I'm upset and I spilled my goddamn tea. Pissed all off now. These guys. While I'm on the sideline over here, I'm gonna pull out my receipts for my hoodie and my shit before they try to stop me and say I'm stealing shit. I got receipts. Just fucking racist and I keep standing. I'm at the fucking abide by no fucking racist just because they say so. Here we are, we're from Walmart, Yuba City. We're gonna see what happens because the fat racist dude wants to see my receipt. I already went outside, came back in. What the fuck I'm gonna bring it? Motherfucker, I hate these stupid motherfuckers. Broke ass, minimum wage making motherfuckers. Always wanna try to fucking. I'm about to clown now. I hope the police is coming. Because I'm making them look stupid in front of them, too, because I got a receipt, bitches. I always look at a motherfucker like he's just up to some no good. Racist motherfuckers. Walmart. This is Walmart. I'm going out here now. We're going out. And I got my receipt. Fuck these crackers. Hey, hello. Hey, now, now, who do I get my fucking apology from? Because either you or the store manager right here owes me an apology. Is coming on way, you like business, yes, Walmart. yes. Excuse me. Do you got the law on the way? Because that's who I would like to speak to. I have no idea. Because if you guys got a problem with the law, then, then I can speak to them. Do you have the law on the way, you said, Jamie? I don't know. Oh. Okay, because I got my motherfucker receipt. Before y'all get that. Yes, there we go. Oh, sorry, Jamie. I didn't mean to. Hey, I, excuse me, you're the store manager, right? No, I'm looking for the head manager. She's not here right now. She should be here in the morning. Or whoever's in charge at this moment. That would be it. Nice to meet you, Mark. My name's Travis. Travis All right? And I appreciate you coaching me with respect. This lady right here in the gray hair, aisle number three, was my tender today or cashier or whatever you call them. And I spoke to her through coming through the line. I said, I've been disrespected by your by your uh, security guard all through the damn store because he just, I don't know what he's assuming. He's assuming I stole some shit because I put on the hoodie when I pulled it off the rack. Tried it on and walked up here and paid for the motherfucker. And he just still follows me through the fucking store, man. Travis? Yes, sir. And I apologize about my language. I'm upset right now, and it means no disrespect or nothing I, towards I, anybody. I completely understand that you're doing yeah. whole I understand. Okay. okay. So that's why I'm trying to step away, getting out of people's way. Um, and I don't mean no disrespect to nobody. Okay. Then they surround me, talking about I need to get out the store. Okay. Uh, right, Try to remove me from Walmart. I had just came back into the store mm -hmm. to purchase a soda. Purchase a drink. I don't know if the law is on their way or if I got if I've done some sort of infraction of law and violation. But what is the problem and why are they stopping me and telling me I have to leave the store? Oh, what is, why did they tell you you have to leave the store? That's why they haven't told me. They just said leave. They don't care. Leave. 
I said, man, I, what do you mean? I haven't done nothing wrong. I haven't broken no crime. I haven't disrespected nobody. Why do you, you want me to leave? I have for receipts the... for mine. Yes, I do. I have receipts for my product. I have a hoodie and a t-shirt that I paid for in cash. Not only that, but I showed this dumb fat ass that I have pocket full of money. And how the hell is he going to sit here and call me a thief? So, and until he, until he, and, uh, I apologize. I just felt that he, the way he handled it is severely unprofessional and out of, he's a new one. I don't know. Uh, Steven, Steven, come forward. Bring forward. Come on. Hey, you need to answer some questions to this dude. Yes, I what you need to I had John caught him on the section here with this item here with the car. If he's not proven on the seat on it. He has a receipt. He has a return huh? seat. He didn't want to show us anyone. Okay. I have a receipt, Steve. Now, what's your apology? Do you have a receipt that shows it? Yeah, he's got your business. He told you I had a receipt. You're the store manager? Am I clear with my merchandise, sir? I don't know what you're talking about. Store manager. Am I, do I get an apology or not, Steve? That's an apology for me. Okay, I'm am I free to go? Me. Am I free to leave Walmart because he's seen my receipt or not? Who told me I had to get out of Walmart? Hold on. Which one of y'all? Because y'all act like this is crazy around here, man. Y'all so fucking racist. No, I want an apology for him. Or you, or, 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 or from her, I don't understand, you haven't done nothing wrong, so please, you ain't done it wrong, Mark. But one of them niggas owe me an apology. I'm sorry, but they, they owe me an apology, man, I don't know plan with that. They broke ass minimum wage people. Where's he at? I'm sorry, but you gotta understand that he disrespected me in front of a lot of people. He disrespected me in front of a lot of people. He drug it out publicly. So now that he made it a public situation, it's a public situation, sir. Let me ask you a question. Did you did you show him your receipt on the Huh? I was in the back when he started messing with me and approaching me. You're not asking my question. Okay? You owe me apology, dude. Shut up. You the supervisor here? You owe me apology, dude. You work here, don't you? Did you show him your receipt? No, you you never asked me for a receipt. No. Did you show him a receipt when they asked you for one? Never, never, Did never asked ask me for a receipt. receipt. No, he approached me yeah, in the store in, in McDonald's, bro. I asked you for your receipt. No, you did not. No, you did not. Did you approach me where? So, in McDonald's. I approached where was I coming from? I said, sir, you need to take off. You talk to him, man. That's your boss. That's your boss. You approached me to stop me. I'm about some shit I paid for already. Racist ass motherfucker. I'm sorry, man. I'm out of here. You leave me the fuck alone. Can I get my apology? I didn't think so. Fuck out of here. Don't disrespect me ever again because that's racist as fuck as you. And I pay for everything. Broke ass, petty, minimum wage making motherfucker. Huh? And okay, I'm out of here. You still owe me a problem, Steven. Fuck all y'all. Fuck all y'all. Call the law, nigga. That's, I'm in that motherfucker. Yeah. Ain't broke no law. Ain't broke no law. Tell him he's wrong, though, Mark. Now, now that's the point where you get Tell him he's wrong, though, Mark. And I'll have a nice day. Just, yet, yeah, still, you still know you're wrong. I can make no. a scene. I'm wrong. You're still wrong for the jump. I don't have you to stop me, punk. Punk, sir. You have a nice day. You stop me, punk. You got a problem with what I say? I'm in the parking lot, punk. We got my receipt too, fat boy. Walmart, Yuba City, world star, fuck them. Woo! And I got it all on video, chump, fat boy.